Ah, Pyrrhus of Epirus, are you ready to begin your journey into Rome? I think he is quite a good commander here, 281 BC. So first of all, we've got to dock the boats at port, and yes, get him in then. Do I want to sail yet, or do I want to give it one more turn? I think I should... Uh, yeah, give it one more turn. Because there's a Greek army here in Brutii territory. Now, technically, we should go help them out, but... We might be better if the Romans at Tarentum actually battled them first, came out of the settlement, and then we can, like, ambush them at the heel of Italy, cut them off, and kill them here. Yeah, that's my plan. So the goal of this campaign is to take Rome and secure Sicily under Greek rule. Uh, can I do it? I don't know. Just going to be a mini little thing to see if I can do it. First of all, I want good relations with the Greeks. So head over to Fermon. The spy, yeah, he has to go on the boat as well. What other units do we have? So we've got his son Alexander and Ptolemy. I'll probably send them to Rome eventually, but for now, they can stay here. We're losing a lot of money. Yeah, our troops are very expensive. I'm actually tempted to disband a unit of these. Yeah, go on then. Just to save a little bit more money. Right, taxes up to high. And very high. We need every penny we can get. 2,000 gold for 200 per turn? Sure. Get a wooden palisade in queue as well. Yeah, that'll be good. Uh, what do we need down here? What What are our temples? Yeah, the basic Greek ones. Uh, farming, that could be good. Uh, I think, actually, yeah, because it's cheap. Go for that. Get a bit extra farming. Yeah, this provides plus one food. This is plus two, but, you know, this is like... Uh, the farms are three times more expensive, uh, or for three times more, so might as well go for the temple. Yeah, get it really cheap there. Uh, we can only get levy pikemen, but I don't think we'll be going for too many units at the start. Uh, four command, four management, four influence, and here, five command. Alright, let's see what the world's response is going to be to the existence of Epirus in the game. Alright, yes, that's what I wanted. Yes, right. So, the Greeks got destroyed. Uh, that's not what I really wanted. Of course, I would have loved to see that tiny Greek army destroy the Romans, but that wasn't going to happen. But they weakened them and cut them off as well, which I did want. Ooh, what do we do? Do we go straight in for the settlement? We have the elephants for it. That could be really good. Or do we surround them? I think we go for the settlement. Yeah, try it a little bit different. Yes, sir. Right, sail round here. That's where their fleet is. Get off the boat, now we can attack. Alright, easy little win there. That was quite good for us. We didn't really lose anyone. Uh, it was the elephants that allowed us to get in uh, that quickly. And... I am going to exterminate the population. Yeah, because we need the money. Like, we were minus 2k gold at that point after turn 1. Uh, any chance we can just... We can still move. Or is this actually going to be possible? Can we actually... Oh, I don't think we have the range. Yeah, we're just out of range. Ah, oh, that is unfortunate. What can we build here? Right, rebuild all that. Go for the temple. Put taxes on high. Ah, oh, I thought I could have got the, the Brutii I killed on that turn. That would have been... That would have been really good, but sadly not. Yeah, and we're not going to beat that fleet. Alright, we'll have to wait a turn. Uh, just taking a look at some of these units here. That's quite good. 16 attack, 25 defense. Uh, the foot companions, and we also have Epirut Sacred Cavalry. Uh, which I'm excited to use as well. Alright, we already have an alliance and trade, so... Might as well just ask for money instead. See if I can get some of that out of them. 
Uh, oh, they're making demands? Oh, no. No, 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 no. Alright, Macedon want trade, I would accept. Of course. Just anything to get as much money as possible flowing into the nation. Because it's quite a big army we're paying for, look. Minus 1.5k in debt again. Well, anyway, uh, they've not moved, which is perfect for us. Uh, let's send the spy a little bit more ahead. Alright, and we can put Croton under siege. So, yeah, let's let's just go for it. Three generals in there. Faction leader, faction heir. Alright, exterminate population, I think. Yeah. And there we go. Right, we destroyed the Brutii. Very good start, but it's not going to be that easy throughout. Uh, we still got to take Rome, and most of Rome's armies are up here. Like the Brutii, they're meant to be the baby's first battle sort of thing. Oh, lovely. He is filthy-minded. Just what I wanted to know. Uh, put him into Ventum. Alright, well, that's where the Scipii army came from, uh, just sailed up. And they docked a full stack in there, don't know what their original plan was. Um, I would really like another spy, but oh, we cannot afford one. Right, get the army regrouped somewhere around here. We have to take Rome. Alright, so I've regrouped my army, got a couple of generals in here as well. The skirmishers, I left them behind. I'm not a skirmisher player, as many of you know. I much prefer the longer ranged archers, right. Move forwards as far as we can, still in debt. Where are the Julii? Oh, that is two massive armies right there. I'm a little worried. Ah, Gaul, yes, I will accept. Alright, I'm at minus 3.2k gold in debt. The Scipii put a fort here, I cannot get through that. Yeah, it's like he's warning me, nope, nope, don't do it boss. How about we go for the Julii? What's round here? Oh, we don't have that good vision. Right, I'm gonna march into Julii territory and just see what happens. Uh, I'm not liking this uh, situation right now. Ah, uh, rebels attacking my fleet, we're lost. Well, there goes our, our retreat option. Alright, no, we're still alive. We're still alive. So yeah, we can retreat if need be, but I don't like the looks of that retreat. The rebels, they'll probably hit us. Right, I cannot take a look at the Julii. Right, that's Rome. Do I... I think I go and look at the Scipii. Right, they've left the fort unoccupied. Wait, if, if this is their last settlement, then we can attack it, can't we? Yes, yes, they all not occupied the fort and we got through. Oh, typical Pyrrhus of Epirus outsmarting the Romans here. Uh, but this one, I think I'm going to have to fight it. Right, that's the reinforcing army. I think I can catch them. Right, they'll be coming on the left-hand side of the battle. Yeah, should be possible. We have enough cav for it. Yeah, we definitely have enough cav for it. It's almost our entire army. Right, I think they're coming in from over here. And as for the settlement... Oh, yeah, don't let our elephants go berserk. Uh, gotta be careful of that. I don't think there's anything we can do with our infantry yet. Uh, maybe set them up over here. We might find some use for them. Uh, but our goal really is to uh, cut off the reinforcements. All right, good. They're all the way over there. Perfect. Right, so... They're done a... Go down here, they've got a bit of low ground. We might actually... I, I had a, a thought for a second, maybe break into the settlement and capture the plaza, but... No. We're in too much of a good spot right now. Don't get too greedy. Alright, their general is leading the charge. Our archers are firing. Right, send in some cav. Come on, phalanxes are down. Yep, elephants firing as well. Okay. Right, we've got to kill the generals here. Come on, archers. Right, good for getting a load of good kills. Come on. Come on, we need this to work for us. We don't start off in a that good position, really. Like, we're outnumbered, I think, four to one, so we have to play a little bit more like this. All right, then. Don't let them get behind the phalanxes. So send in the cavalry. Send in the elephants as well. Yeah, they should be fine. They should be dealt with. Yeah, keep the cavalry safe. 
Right, good. Um, elephants and archers stop firing to avoid friendly fire. Ah, oh, actually, they didn't retreat into the settlement, aren't they? Right, that's okay. Yeah, if it's the generals doing that, that's okay. But the infantry cannot be allowed to retreat. Ah, uh, you know what, maybe just big calf charge here. General in first. They got their peeler in, but we did break them. Right, now turn round. Go for them, we got reinforcements as well. Right, good, we broke them. Don't let them retreat. Archers still doing a good job. The elephants here as well, lowering enemy morale. Alright, and then you start heading more over that way. Charge for Principes. Alright, now pull out. Pull out of there. I don't want to engage the Triarii. I want to try and avoid them at all cost. Uh, right, so you fire at the Triarii. Yep, cavalry, run them all down now that they're broken. Perfect, the generals got away, but that's, that's fine. They don't have infinite morale on the plaza anyway. So that's not a problem. Uh, they're actually doing a really good job against our phalanx, which is a bit annoying. Uh, try and charge the cavalry in. Come on, run them down, you idiots. They're doing a really terrible job there. Keep the elephants safe. If the elephants go berserk, we lose. Right, good, we broke them. Maybe try and go for those now. Alright, this is, this is stupid. Come on, soldiers. I don't know why you're letting them get away like this. No, come on, don't let them get away. Actually try and kill them. Alright, now we got them at last. Right, uh, get out of there. Ah, some got away though. Alright, this bug is sending me crazy. I'm losing too many troops to the towers. Yeah. Uh, just let them get away then. There we go, we got at least that squad right. Oh, I would love this job. <laughs> Just smashing your head against the wall until it falls down. <laughs> hey, well done, elephants. Well done. Now that's a brave trinket. Oh. <laughs> all by himself, running in there through all the ammo fire, getting his peeler ready. Uh, but sadly, he died. Alright, the general from earlier. Surely this time we get him. Maybe not. <laughs> I saw another general go around this way. Now he went back to Plaza, God. Oh, no, we didn't get him. Okay. <laughs> Alright, now my elephants are leading their general right outside of the Plaza. And uh, around this way, which I did not expect to happen. Are they just going to keep on following me? Like, I've got my cavalry ready here for them. Alright, you know what I think they are. Alright then, let's uh, get prepared for this. Alright, get the elephants to lead them near enough out of the settlement. Or at least back here. Come on, elephants. We're not losing any, I don't think. So we are fine to do this. Come on. Oh, why have they been getting bugged on this spot here? Come on. I don't want to just fight him with my elephants because... Although we'll probably win it, I don't want to lose my elephants. Uh, they are quite the powerful tool for us. Come on, wake up. Ah, oh, this is this is not looking good. Do I just charge him with the cavalry now? Yeah, I've got to. We lost them. Ah, oh, now just hope they don't go berserk. Ah, oh, that was so annoying. They just got stuck on this bit here. I don't know why it was. Oh well, our cavalry survived anyway. I was hoping to like trap them in, minimize losses, but ah, oh, oh well. All right, elephants have returned to the field, but. Can't really use them at this point. Uh, too much risk. Oh no, I've gone berserk. Oh, poo. Oh, that's so annoying, right? Everyone get out of their way. Oh, they're gonna kill themselves on the towers as well, aren't they? Right, we gotta charge right in then. Just go, get in there. Nothing we can do. Yeah, they're killing themselves on the towers. Oh, my luck is terrible at times. Right, come on, phalanxes. You need to just get in there and do what you can. There we go, perfect. Yeah, just like, we're just eating them, basically. Eat them into the phalanx. Keep the general nearby. Uh, come on, stay in phalanx mode. All right, yeah, keep pressing backspace to keep them in phalanx mode. Where are the elephants? Right, they're off. Good. And they're coming back again. <laughs> come on, gotta be quick. 
And the final two generals. Oh, that's so adorable how they were walking together. One down, two down, boom. The win. Oh, there's like two guys over here as well. Yep. <laughs> there we go. Oh, that battle took far too long. I was trying to minimise losses and perfect it, but... Oh, we just got a bit of bad luck at times, and yeah. Still, it was like a really good win, like... <laughs> I'm happy with that victory, but... I, I always know that I could have done it better, and that always gets to me. And a shame about the elephants as well, but... Oh, well. Anyway, Skippy I now dead. Uh, we're still in debt, though, uh, which is not good. Uh, we can We can't replenish our pikemen. Yeah, we have really good troops. Yeah, like, that's the next team up, isn't it? Oh, oh, these are really good troops. Uh, but there's nothing we can do. All right, next stop, Rome. Uh, but our army right now is a little bit battered. Oh, we're out of debt. It's only 20 gold, but we're out of debt. Good, perfect. Uh, right, what can we spend that 20 gold on? Uh, sadly, nothing. Uh, nothing at all. Right. Ah, that's where the Julii are. Two armies right there. The Senate is here. How am I going to play this? I I'm not liking the position right now. Yeah, it's like if I go for the Julii, I'll have to go this way round. And then that will leave Capua open. But if I go this way, then that would risk the Julii joining up with the Romans. And... Yeah, I don't want to fight them like that, but I think... I think I've got to give it one more turn. Yeah, just end turn, do nothing. I think... Yeah, wait for the AI to make a mistake. That's what I have to do. Okay, good. I'm liking this a little bit better. Or am I? They're in range of Tarentum. Which I don't like. The rebels are blocking me off, which I didn't want. Hmm... Do I have a general round here? I could pick one up from Salona, but nowhere else. Can I just squeeze one round? Nope. I'm thinking of building a little fort here, keeping them trapped in. Right, I'll give that a go. Meanwhile, this army, yeah, leave behind the weaker unit and go for the Senate. So, originally, this was just meant to be one video, but uh, the recording time took three times longer than I originally expected it to, so, yeah, I decided to cut it up into two parts instead, so, you know, important parts don't get cut, and, you know, so it doesn't feel too long, and stuff like that. Uh, hopefully, this should work. The mod was made by Eduardo Souza. Uh, big thank you to that person for sending me this mod. Uh, it's linked down below. It comes with a second campaign as well about Caesar in Gaul. You can get the mod as the Pyrrhus of Epirus version, which I am playing, uh, which starts a little further back. Or you can get the normal 270 BC Rome Total War, but with Epirus just in there as a normal faction depending on what type of campaign you want. So yeah, hope you enjoyed this video, subscribe for more, share with anyone you think may be interested. Part 2 will be tomorrow. Hope to see you there, but for now, goodbye.